Hello and welcome to jasonnewland.com. My name's Jason and this is your daily hypnosis session. I hope that you're well. I hope that you can just take a few minutes out of your busy day to relax, to focus on my voice, allow yourself to maybe think a little bit differently, open your mind to new ideas. And close your eyes if it's safe for you to do so. And this is going to be a short session. What I'd like you to do is, it's kind of like a visualization. I want you to think of somebody. Somebody that you have difficulty with. Somebody that maybe you don't get on with very well. Not somebody that's hurt you. But just somebody that you don't quite connect with. And you'd like to connect with them. But you just don't for whatever reason. You don't know why. Or maybe they just annoy you. Or maybe you just up till now you haven't felt comfortable in their company. Or you get tongue tied or you know whatever it could be but as I said not someone that's hurt you or upset you or anything like that just somebody that you just can't really put your finger on it but there's just don't really connect yet with that person and this session is going to be focused on giving you a tool to connect and literally to connect there's not really much you need to do it really is a case of just following my words and it's kind of like a visualization and it's a bit of a strange thing it's a bit it's going to be unusual and that's fine Okay. Because a lot of the things that I do and say are quite unusual, but they're also effective, which is the ultimate thing. In the past, people have asked me what kind of therapist I am. I say, are you a person centered counselor? Are you a cognitive? behavioral therapist, are you a gestalt therapist, uh, you know, are you integrative, and I say no, I'm an effective counsellor, and it might sound cocky, but for me that's what it's about, is what we do effective, is it helpful, and it's not going to be helpful for everybody, of course not. But the point is, is it effective with us, me and you? So what I'd like you to do with your eyes closed is I'd like you to just imagine yourself standing or sitting, it's up to you, in front of a full length mirror. And just see yourself. And as you look into that mirror, I want you to see the reflection of yourself turn and become fuzzy. You see the outline of yourself become fuzzy. And then you can see your face become fuzzy. And your body, your arms, your legs, your entire body and outline fuzzy. As if you are squinting your eyes or if you've been wearing glasses you've taken them off or if you've been looking maybe at the sun you shouldn't have done or a light bulb and things are not quite in focus and then things start to become more focused and as that image becomes more focused you notice that the image is now that person that person that in the past 
you had difficulties with, couldn't quite connect in the past. And as you look in the mirror, your own reflection being that person, I'd like you just to move one of your hands and notice that a reflection also moves their hand in exactly the same way. Now move the other hand if you can and notice that the reflection, the connection, moves in exactly the same way. And maybe moving your head from side to side and noticing how the connected reflection moves in exactly the same way. Maybe nodding your head up and down and only do what feels comfortable for you physically to do as you notice that the connected reflection moves in exactly the same way. And notice how you feel in your chest, in your stomach, in your neck, in your throat, in the, maybe in your mind, your jaw. Just notice how you physically feel emotionally. And notice how you feel emotionally as this connection is building. As if you're connected in an invisible connection between each other's minds, each other's bodies, hearts. Because we are ultimately all connected by energy, that's a scientific fact. Just because we can't see it, we can't see electricity, but it doesn't stop us from switching the light on. So, although it's invisible, it's still there. All this does is give you an opportunity to maybe switch on the light. Turn it on. Turn on that connection between you and that person. Click, it's on now. And see how you get on with it now. And that brings us to the end of this session. So you can let that mirror just move away. You can open your eyes when you're ready to do so. And you can enjoy the rest of the day or evening, feeling wonderful. Please let me know how you get on. You take care. Bye.